meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. And it looks like most of those games should get in okay tonight. Uh, the rain chance is really, for the most part, holding off until late this evening as we go past 9, 10 o'clock. So uh, late evening, early morning hours, we'll have that chance of thunderstorms. Until then, uh, temperatures dropping off into the upper 70s, lower into the 80s, and down into the mid-70s at 11 o'clock once that rain gets underway. Cloudy skies tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock. Could be a spotty shower at that time, but most of the rain should have ended. Uh, some breaks in the clouds at noon, and then more thunderstorms flaring up in the afternoon. Some of those could be strong to severe once again, and temperatures will start to cool off by later in the day, 75 at 5 o'clock. So some thunderstorms late this evening and overnight. Heavy rain, wind will be a concern, a slight risk of severe storms west of us in central Indiana, back into central Illinois, a marginal risk for us, so it doesn't look like a real high chance, but definitely the chance of some heavy rain. We were talking about that flash flood watch that will go into effect at 8 o'clock. More strong storms Saturday afternoon. You can just about see where the cold front is. With those storms coming in, uh, well, that's not the graphic we wanted to look at right there, but definitely some more strong storms will be headed our way. You can see that uh, front setting off the thunderstorms across Ohio and back into central Ohio and eastern uh, uh, sections of uh, uh, the Buckeye State, also down into West Virginia. So this area will have the greatest risk tomorrow. We'll probably see that line developing right over the Dayton area as those storms move in. And cooler, lower humidity air settles in across the Miami Valley on Sunday. A high storm. Tomorrow looks like upper 70s to the north and west, low 80s for us, 86 Cincinnati, but 70s to the west. Check out our dew points. They'll be around 70, which is where they've been for a good part of the week. But lower humidity air late Saturday afternoon and into Sunday, that'll start to swing into the area, and then we'll get back to some really nice conditions on Sunday. Checking out the SVG Chevrolet camera up in Greenville tonight. You can see partly cloudy skies, but at least at this point, no rain threatening the Greenville area, and it's dry on live Doppler 2 HD as we look at downtown Dayton. Uh, there have been a couple of light sprinkles coming across the eastern part of Indiana. A couple of light showers now into the western part of Wayne County, Indiana. Really not amounting to much. That area has been weakening as it's been moving eastward. More interested in the thunderstorms flaring up just to the east of St. Louis. Those storms will head eastward right along Interstate 70. And that's what could begin to impact our area late this evening. Right now, 83 in Dayton. Southwest wind at 6. Feels Feels like 86 and temperatures across the region tonight. You can see our weather checkers in the 80s. Barbara Richards in Kettering, 85 degrees. Areas south of us picking up a lot of rain last night. So greatest potential for additional flooding would be in those areas if they see some heavy thunderstorms come through. And we'll have that chance in the wee hours of the morning. Then tomorrow, more thunderstorms flaring up as a cold front moves through. And behind that front, in comes the nice weather just in time for the end of the weekend. Looks like a lot of sunshine on Sunday. Day with lower humidity, air, and cooler temperatures. Tonight, showers, thunderstorms. Some of those could produce heavy rain later tonight. Overnight, low around 70 degrees. Tomorrow, more scattered thunderstorms. Best chance in the afternoon. High 83. And we'll find the hour by hour temperature 75 at 10 o'clock, 80 degrees at noon, and then slipping off later in the day tomorrow as the rain gets underway. And then look at the nice weather. Sunday's high uh, up to 75 degrees after morning low of 57, 80 for the high on Monday. Monday morning low 53, and then Tuesday 84 for the high temperature, 75 on Wednesday with those scattered showers and thunderstorms. So looking nice early next week. Yeah, we just got to get there. Mm -hmm. Yep, that's the trick. Next 24 <laughs> hours, a little bumpy. Okay, Brian, thanks.